I love this so, so much. It is so good to see you, Lisa. It really is. And it's, I binged the whole thing. So I know what happens, so I have to be very careful not I to know. give too much away because there are still two episodes to there go. Are. It's so beautifully written. It really is so beautifully written. I'm a firm believer that Stefan Galajowski is a genius. Yes. He really is. He is... Um, you don't often read a script like Mum. Um, they, I think they'll probably, it'll probably be the only time it comes along <laughs> in my career that I've read something that I've just gone, oh my God, this is just <laughs> wonderful. I need to be in it. That's but yeah, great. it's 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 a very special show. And she is a remarkable character because sometimes she she's is. so ridiculous. I think she's learned a lot from Cathy. No, um, yeah. indeed. <laughs> and I think as well, you must, you know, somebody like Leslie Manville and Peter Mullen, yeah. of course, mm -hmm. great cast that you've got. Must be like a masterclass in acting, just watching them. It really is. Just watching them perform. They yeah. are both phenomenal. And I think it's some of the best casting, actually. Yeah. I, like, I would never have sort of thought of well, no. Peter in that role, no. for example, because he's normally cutting people's heads off. Indeed, he is but, the hard um, man. He's, he yeah. really is the hard man. And I think this series in particular, it's, it's quite dark, yeah. actually. And I think you see all of those characters having being like very vulnerable and um, having a moment. And they're all having a bit of a wobble this series. That was one of the notes throughout. They're, they're all sort of struggling with something. No, that makes um, sense. That makes perfect sense, yeah. it really does. And Leslie, of course, in Real True Life, yeah. opened her home to you. Oh, she did. Tell me what happened. She saved, she <laughs> saved me, actually. When we were filming the second series, I had um, a little boy, I've got a little boy called Joshy, and my husband was working away in Budapest, and my mum was looking after him, and I was doing lots of commuting to get to work. and. I I was just, I hit a brick wall. Mm. I got to sort of week eight and I was like, I can't actually continue. I'm, mm. I can't do this commute anymore. And then um, Leslie lived just down the road from this, like she was about 10 minutes away from the studio, whereas yes. I was two hours away from it. Right. And so she moved my mum and my dad and my little boy, Joshy, into her house. She did not. <laughs> yeah, she did. What an amazing we just, we just all moved in for a couple of weeks. <laughs> really? and, um, and But it just meant that, you know, Joshy could come and, uh, oh. on a lunch break and I could feed him and I Wonderful. could. Wonderful, yeah, because yeah. he was teeny tiny then he was about yeah. five months old when we wow. did the second series whereas this i mean he's two and a half now right. so i went on holiday for 10 weeks <laughs> to film the third series we all went in you know we were working in this beautiful stately home That's and right. staying in a hotel down the road and we were just on holiday but what a lovely woman to do that oh she what i mean a lovely kind woman i can't sort of express how much i love leslie manville i mean but we're like really good friends now without giving anything away but oh. should it all end the way we hope I think, should it do that. I think it's a really satisfying end right. to the series. And okay. um, I think lots of people have binge watched it because they've put the whole... Totally. I, well, you did it, didn't yeah, you? And I, I think it's actually the perfect way to watch it. If you haven't seen it yet, binge watch it. Oh, binge watch it's wonderful. It's, it, it's, it's really it's satisfying. It's on the old iPlayer, isn't it's it? It's on iPlayer. But if it all goes the way we hope that it might, but maybe even if it doesn't, We've got, can we not, can you have a word with Stefan the writer and say, could he please do a Christmas special? Lorraine, I need you to start a campaign. Year. Maybe you could, I think, think if you say it, you, you know, people happen? will listen. Do you think, <laughs> I don't know that they will, but I will do my best. I just can't bear to say bye-bye to these characters. I can't, I'm, and we're, we're all so sad, but I Stefan, we always knew it was going to be three, three series, mm -hmm. and it's sort of, we don't want to over-egg the pudding. You I know, know, but still... But still, but still, there's still stories to, to be one. told. I there's know. still stories to be told. I want to see what Kelly and Jason's baby is like and what they're like as parents. But I imagine, wouldn't it be hilarious if the baby turned out to be an absolute genius? Yeah, you know, the baby probably would. talking at the age <laughs> of one and a half. Stefan, yeah, we, have to make, we have to make it happen. It's a joy to talk to you. Thank you it's for mum. It's a joy mom. to be here. Thank, Thank you for mum.